Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Let's Play Inwards. Now this is a game that's actually made on the Source Engine, which I haven't played a horror mod for the Source Engine in a long time. Um, it was released on Game Jolt very recently and from what I saw, it was very extremely well made. A high level of quality from what I uh, could see, not in like the actual graphics of the game, but just in, in how it was made and the design of it. So, I mean, it's obviously made on the Source Engine, so it's got a pretty powerful uh, thing for it, but... You know, powerful engine behind it. But uh, then again, Unity and um, Unreal Engines aren't exactly wimpy. So, but I mean, I'm not saying expect the greatest graphics ever in the world. That's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is take this game with a grain of salt and let's see what it's going to happen. Let's have some fun. Ooh, nice fire effects. I can see the budget was there. But no. Okay. So I'm entering a haunted house, which is a pretty typical cliche in terms of games, I'm guessing. Why I'm entering this haunted house is beyond me. I don't have a flashlight. And I see many things. That is the old familiar half-life sound. There's the old familiar half -life. Is that night all that is left of you? Are you trapped on that dark road because there isn't an exit or because you can't find one? I sometimes wonder whether you remember the sound of my voice or if it's just another noise in the background. I will try again. I will try one last time. Do you still remember her story? Whose story? Who's still- whoa. Um... Okay, then. That doesn't seem good. What about the other rooms in this house? Oops. Oh, hey. What the? Oh. Well, alright then, it's just the bed. And the cabinet. Is this my house? Or is this someone else's house? And who is she that I need to remember? So many questions. So few answers. It's funny because when I see things like this, I think, Prop Hunt! Need to turn into that bathtub, but no. Must not do that. Prop Hunt turn into that lamp. Oh no. This is well, okay then, abnormally loud ladder. You have a nice day. Oh, there's water here. This doesn't make any sense. Why is there water here? Of all places. On a wooden floor. Never mind. Oh, this is nice. Hello. Oh, look at their little physically interactable objects. Isn't that lovely? Okay, so, um, uh, yeah. Hello, excuse me. Pardon me. Ah, get out of the way. I said, oh. I may need you. I'm gonna take you with me, because you're actually light. You are actually a light source. Thunk. Thank. Hope no monsters find me. A boom, bang, boom. Whoops. My bad. Sorry. Did you not wait one? Huh? Okay, I don't know what was going on there, but this is apparently my only source of light, so I'm gonna cherish it and take it with me and protect it dearly. Hello? Well, 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 this doesn't look pleasant. A long hallway. Wonder if someone's try pushing. You talking to me? Am I birthing a baby? Try pushing. Pushing! Oh, hello. You're good, there's blood on the floor. Okay! Node graph out of date, rebuilding! What? Oh good! I woke up in a dirty, stanky hospital! Surrounded by more dirty, stanky rooms! Another trope of horror games, which is hospitals, but... Hi lady! How you doing? You gonna come to kill me? Uh. What's going on here? Something don't feel right. Something feels wrong. Okay. Door is locked. I gotta go to this one flapping in the wind. The wind of inside this hospital. What is this? Hello? Oh! Ooh! <laughs> what am I in? Whoa. No, turn it back on! Turn it back on! Oh, come on! Turn it back on! Why did you turn it off? Why did you turn it off? Why did you turn it off? Okay, this is much moodier anyway, so I guess that's all that really matters. Okay. Why is it so quiet? What is going on? 
That's what I always ask in these horror games. What is going on? But I don't know why I do because I never get a definitive answer. Very rarely do these horror games, especially the indie ones, tell me exactly why I am do what I do. And what is this? Some. Oh, so this game was made in Britain land, eh? I have unt batteries. What does that mean? Did I turn on the radiation screening? Do I need to turn it off now? Will this kill me? Ow! Didn't even hurt. Okay. Oh good! Long blinking hallway! So I'm gonna... So I'm gonna... So I'm gonna, you know? So I'm gonna, you know? Okay. Alright. Okay, so far so good! Oh! Oh, my flashlight! Is that the way out? Is that the way out? My flashlight is now dead. What does that even mean? A girl wandered through the dreary spring rains on a starless moonless night. A dull pendant held tightly in her hand. The water ran from her cloak and into the marshy grass. Counting her footsteps one at a time, she could swear that every so often she'd hear a step out of time. And a sound coming from the distance. Vivian knew that she had to keep moving onwards towards the north. Where she'd find her home on the other side of the river. The pendant tugged gently in the way she was headed. Casting a faint blue glow upon the horizon. Okay. Well, what does that mean? Or what does that mean? What does that mean? There was a flashlight. Wait. Let's put the blind. Look, what? Let's click the blind. What? Blind myself? What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Who are you? Let's click the. Ah! Is it, is it gonna get me? What are they gonna do? What is it? Ah! Hey! Whoa, what the? I guess I got away from it. <laughs> Whatever it was. Oh, I see. I just went into a portal of demonic hell. That's good. That's good. One thing that I'm, I, I would like to point out for this game, it really could do with some ambiance. Ground floor master key found. That's good. <gasps> Why is it senator? Don't be so creepy! Don't be so creepy. Why are you gonna be creepy? You're slightly disturbing! I'm gonna go now. You better not follow me. You better not follow me. You better not follow me. Okay. Okay. Alright. Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's close these. Okay. Close them. Hey, wait a minute. No, this is the hallway that I was on. Ah! Wait a minute. There was a Oh, wait. No, that's right. Yeah, this is where I came from originally. I need to. Oh, loading. Good. This actually was quite a large download, by the way. It was about a gig to download this entire game. Actually, no, the download is 400 megs, but when it came out extracted, it was a gig. Oh, wow. I found a lot of batteries for my flashlight. Don't know why I needed that many, but I think it might have the Afraid of Monsters mechanic style, uh, flashlight where, um, you only have a limited amount of battery, but you can recharge very slowly if you turn it off and you're out, so that you're never completely out. Oh, no, wait. Afraid of Monsters complete. I'm thinking of a different game. Why are the lights turning out? Is that thing gonna appear behind me? That thing's gonna appear behind me, ain't it? Or in front of me. Or around me. Or somewhere. Oh, look, another blue portal. I keep expecting. I keep expecting that thing to be there. And more batteries. Could always use more batteries. Oh, good. I'm outside now. Why? 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 Uh, what? Uh, oh, but just pushed it. Okay, it was just pushed it open. Okay. Nestled in the hollow stump of an oak that sat in the shadow of a derelict lumber mill, Vivian settled, weary from the trek through the darkness. Through a gap in the rotting wood, she saw a glimmer of light appear, followed by another and many more. The clouds had finally parted, and the stars shone more brightly than they had ever before. So far away, yet so full of life, her father had once told her that stars were like a photo- like a lot like photographs, reminders of distant things to be cherished. She wondered to herself why her gift wanted to be taken from her. Well, I don't know. Is that thing around here? I'm very concerned about the status of whatever the hell that thing is. And why it was following me. Hi, I see you. Are you Vivian? Are you Vivian over there? 
Is that you, Vivian? V -v 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 is that you, Vivian? Oh boy, another portal into another dimension. I can't escape this one. Oh, good, I can. What happens if I just don't go in it? Oh, I can't progress. Uh, what did that mean? Oh, okay. All right. I guess I'll go outside again. <laughs> The warm rays that had shone down through the trees and dim once again, welcoming an invisible chorus of churching, chirping as the evening set in. I am having so much trouble reading today. The nights began to grow warmer in the forest. Occasionally a branch would snap somewhere in the distance and the leaves would shift and shuffle. It was still out there, but Vivian knew while, that while she was surrounded by her chirping friends, she would be safe. Even if she could not see them, they'd keep her safe from it. Occasionally she would find a shell attached to the trunk of a tree, another reminder like the every starry sky and every dusty photograph. As the night she... At the night set in, she hid in an abandoned den below the earth that seemed to be another thing left behind by a weary soul. Yeah, I don't know. I apologize. I'm having a sincere trouble. Uh, excuse me. Who broke some glass? Yeah, I'm having a lot of trouble reading today, and I don't know why. Uh, my speaking skills are just not up to par. Oh, the pendant had barely left her pocket in some weeks or maybe months, beginning to forget who she was, seemed to bring more hope than holding on to the truth. The leaves began to turn to brown and orange, falling from the trees they were once part of. Vivian extended a hand and touched the rough bark of the maple. The tree stood tall and strong, drawn upwards by the delicate leaves that came and went. She wondered if one day she would use her gift to show the people who'd taken her away that every life was just as important. She produced the pendant from her pocket and followed its gentle pull onwards through the leafy wood. The leaves crackled distantly in the pattern of footsteps. Um, it was always there, watching her whenever she remembered that she carried a gift of giving life, followed closely by the weight of it brought. The, by the weight it brought. One day beyond the river, the weight will be lifted when she finds her way home. And when I can stop messing up! Okay, anyway. So, what about that? What did I do? The gate break release. What is that? What is that? What did that do? Something about this or do I need to go back? I have a feeling I may need to go back. What the hell? What? Wait a minute. No, 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 no. Something happened. Something happened that wasn't supposed to happen. Oh no. Did I break the game? Did I pull this lever before I was supposed to pull it? Oh no. Oh no. I done goofed. Oh God. What have I done? What have I done? Have I broken it? I have a feeling I'm supposed to be in there. Somehow. Oh no. Wait, to avoid. Oh, I know what I need to do. Ah, I need to overload it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got this. Yeah, there it goes. All right. What did I do? What did that do? What did it? Did that do something? Yeah! All right! All right, all right. Oh, what? 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 Oh, okay. There was just an invisible wall there. Oh, I thought I had broken the game. Very sincerely, I thought I did. Oh, come on. Wait, what? I could really use with some sound in this game. Like I said, just a little bit of a Excuse me? Pardon? What was that? Did you say something to me? What is... Fused collected. Okay. Um... Damn it, I got no flashlight. It's all blinky blinky. What's that? Whoa! Startled me. What the hell was that? Oh, a fuse. Fuse collected. Well, why did I drop it? Or is that a new one? I'm not sure. I think I'm- what is- what is up with this? What is up with that? That's messed up, man. What the hell is going on here? That's messed up, man. What the hell? Some things in this game seem to be quite off their uh, rockers. Uh, there's another fuse, I guess. Got another fuse! What does it mean? Can I go in that? No, not yet, okay. Fuse! Wait, no. How do I put the fuse in? Wait, did the fuses automatically go in or what? Do I just need to find the last one? I don't know. I don't know. 
I think I may need to find one more before I'm able to go into that portal, do daddy. Don't know why I'd want to, but that's just the way it be. It's actually easier to find him when it was in the darkness. Alright. Oh! Oh, what was wrong with you? What was wrong with you? Oh, what is wrong with your head? What are you? Oh, that was disturbing. Oh, I just- ah! Your eyeballs! What's wrong with you? Can I hide in the darkness? Can I hide in the darkness? Oh, stop looking at me. Stop looking at me. That's right. Go off on your own. I don't know what you're doing. I don't know what's wrong with you. Oh, you're so weird! Oh, just let me go on my own business. It's locked over there. Oh, what is wrong with you? Oh, you're so weird! What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Oh! 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 Oh no! Uh, uh, uh. Okay, so I can't go here until I get the last fuse, but I don't know where the last fuse is. Where's the last fuse? I can't get all the fuses. Oh, I need more batteries. I, I wasted my batteries because I didn't realize that my light was on while I was reading those notes. Where the hell? Where the hell's the last fuse? There's gotta be a place that I haven't gone yet in this Psycho bonkers crazy area. Hey, baby, move it this way. I swear, there's gotta be a place that I haven't gone yet. What is wrong with you? Oh, you're so weird. Oh, 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 don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. What is with this? Everything's broken and weird. That was so strange. I can't find the last fuse. I don't know what to do. Oh, it's. Oh! Ah! Oh! Come on! You gotta be joking me! It was right behind me, the entire time. Ah! Fudge! Jesus! Get the dog out! Oh! 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 He killed me! I didn't know where to go! Ah! Oh, come on! Okay. Well, this is easy. Well, that made it easy to respawn. <laughs> didn't quite expect that. You dick! I saw you spawn. I saw you spawn. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting out of here. Ah! You're an ick, ick, ick. Ah! Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, that was weird. Uh oh. Oh no! The old elevator falling down trope. Oh no! I'm gonna die. Except not, because I can climb up out of the bottom of it, or top of it, or bottom top, or whatever. Alright, once again, I still don't know how I went from going into a house into a hospital. Still don't know what all the portals are about. That's not good. Uh, Vivian? Darling? Vivian? Can you throw, like, a rope or something? Give me a rope or something! Uh. Ah! Uh. Vivian? Uh-oh. Okay. Am I in a s- oh, whoops. I'm in a swamp of some sort. So, uh, I don't have a flashlight anymore either. Ooh. That's quite interesting. Wait, come on. Oh, no, no, no! I was gonna read that! Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, sorry, guys. I meant to read that, but it didn't let me, apparently. Okay, into the blue light. Okie dokie, where am I now? What new nightmare? See, now they have some ambiance with the music there, the little, the low tones, just anything to make it a bit more interesting. Whoa. Something happened here. I'm guessing I'm not supposed to stay in this house. Wait, what? Oh, sorry. Front door over here. Vivian, I'm coming, baby. Whoa. Okay, that's the land thing. Yeah. I'm gonna get in this boat. <laughs> All right, I'm a. Uh, Oh no, there was a note there! Ah! Ah! Vivian darling! Come on, my baby. Come on, my ragtime gal. I, uh. Can I get off the boat now? Can I. Do I have to stay on the boat? Oh, she's gone. Where'd she go? 
My love have disappeared. No. I'm just gonna assume that's Vivian because that would make the most sense here. I'm just gonna stay on my little boat ride. Oh no, I stopped. Okay. Up and off the boat. Uh, can I get off the boat? Thank you. There we go. Back into the hospital, I guess, which is probably for the best. Maybe, I don't know. Creepy son of a bitch over there. Aha! One flashlight. Aha! One dead body in. They've told me that I have no choice and I'm to decide what happens to you. But how is that fair? It isn't fair because nothing is fair. Even when the girl found her way home, how would she know that her father would even still be there? How do I know you're still here? I don't know what to do anymore. Okay, if you say so. Maybe you should just let me go home. As you know, it is entirely your decision. What? What does that mean? What is entirely- But do consider his happiness as well. I am sure he loves you very much. I cannot do it. Why does it have to be me? It's- This is not my fault. I tried, didn't I? Didn't I try hard enough? I am such an idiot. Don't be so hard. Because I know you are still here. Oh, I thought that was a person. <laughs> Please help me. Am I... Am I supposed to pull this lever? What do they do? Oh, I see a blue light. Uh... Okay, then. Uh, okay, then. All right. Into the blue light. Ah! I didn't really have much of a choice there. Maybe I could have walked away from the switch, I don't know. Maybe that was symbolic of pulling the plug on someone, I don't know. A girl wandered through the dreary spring rains on a starless moony, moonlit night. Oh! That was the end?! Wait a minute! <laughs> oh! Hang on. There was a lot of symbolism and something in there. Hang on, I'm trying to piece it together, give me a second. Um... Vivian was a girl trying, uh, there was a story, what the story was all about, Vivian was trying to travel through some dreary woods on a starlit, moonless night where she was trying to make her way to someone and there was some reference to her father of some sort who she didn't even know would still be there. Maybe she was trying to go to the hospital, that's why there was so much set in a hospital with medical equipment. And maybe the man was in a coma and she had to pull the plug? I don't know! I don't know what happened! That's- that's the best guess that I can piece together that wasn't- Like, I missed two notes there. I feel bad about it. Maybe you guys could have paused on one, but I missed the other completely, but... I don't think they would have been, like, that crucial to tell me exactly what was going on. Probably it was, but I missed it anyway. Sincerely apologize for that. I usually don't miss those notes, and I always try to read them, but I didn't! So, if you guys have any idea or you want to play this by yourself, try to piece together maybe something else is there that I missed, you guys can let me know in the comments below, so... Thank you all so much for watching. Click the annotation for more videos that I've done. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye bye! Ah, go! Maybe I'm not doing this. Maybe I gotta. Here, I'll pick on the middle guy. Oh, you're not taller than I am. Hey, come on, come on. I'm here. Come here. One, two, three. One more. I jump. Jump. Damn it, their ankles. Come on. I can't even handle the middle one. Maybe if I just poke them in the ankle with my shirt, they will fall over into another one. Okay, right for the next, right for the next. Uh oh, I forgot about the dancing weirdo. Ow! Oh, got ya! Yeah! I'm the best ever!